How are you doing, Captain? Very well indeed. Permission to come on board? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, man. <laughs> what I always find amazing about Kiwis is you guys downplay it so much, but you've got such a presence, you've got such a market that you're going after. How did this all start? Where did it come from? Rayglass started in uh, 1988. Back then it was more sort of sports fishing and recreational product. A lot of your business though is not New Zealand. We do a lot into Perth, into the, into the western part of Australia. We do a lot into the US, a little bit into Canada. You see our boats out on the America's Cup course every day and there's just hundreds of them running around the harbour. They're all built in Auckland, New Zealand. Something that we can be very, very proud of is that everything that's built in these factories here in New Zealand is supported by local businesses around our communities. The kind of thing that people customise, work me through that. Typically the guy that's setting his boat up for sports fishing is going to be a little bit different to the guy that's setting it up for weekending and, and just cruising around. One of the nice things about dealing with ray glass is you can get what you want. I don't think there's a minimum or a maximum, it's just really down to what suits you and how you're using your product. Do you have ever had a request for martini glass holder? Absolutely. Well, we warranty for 10 years. We haven't had one break yet and... Um, Since 88? Yeah, so... <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Some of them probably bottom of the ocean, no? They won't sink because they're full of foam. They Come again, that. Just they, they won't sink, they're unsinkable. A ray glass boat is unsinkable? Yeah, yeah. So it's all, every cavity under the floor is pumped full of a closed cell foam. Mixes together at a thousand psi and gets expanded through every cavity, like the core of a surfboard. Look at this, Kiwis. They do world fundamental things and you just, yeah, you know, it's fine, it's the way we do it. No worries, mate. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> Let's have a look. You, you got any of these boats on the floor? Yeah, I certainly have. Uh, at the moment I've got one straight down here I can show you if you want to have a look. I mean, this is service with a smile. You want to get a boat, there's a boat. <laughs> Help yourself. <laughs> the effort that goes into designing a new boat. You guys have quite a bit of a unique way how you go about with this one. I think it's because you've got lots of experience. For us, I guess it's a collective of all our experience. So we don't actually necessarily come up with a plan. We have something as an idea. But the boat evolves, basically, so in a lot of cases you can design something and in theory or in paper it, it sounds good, but when you actually come to hop in the boat and, and use it, it, there's better ways you can do it. What's the best part of your job? To be honest with you, seeing the satisfaction of the, the customer and what it means to them. You know, we guys that dream about owning a boat, just seeing them come in and go through that process and then seeing the satisfaction they get when they ring me and say, mate, I've just been out there and hooked up on it a decent snapper and that satisfaction of the customer is what it is all about for me. If you were born on an island, you will definitely need a boat. If you're in New Zealand, one of the boats you definitely have to consider is a ray glass boat. But it's an inspiring company because these guys are sending products all over the world. Everywhere there's open water, great fishing, and as you know, Kiwis get around and so do their boats. <laughs>